Danny! What? Danny, I've got big plans for you. But first, I need you to get a thing for me. Now, I hear you ask, one, what is this thing you need? All you need to know is don't try to eat it, talk to it, or put it in your pants. But one, I hear you ask, where is this thing you need? Head for the radio tower and follow the trail north. It'll take you to an abandoned camp on the east side of the island. I can mark it on your map. You'll meet my contact there. She'll hook you up. And Danny, you pull this off, I'm gonna give you something for pulling me from the bottle. A little gift an old friend gave me for saving his life. Not that you saved my life, just... I get the fuck out of here. Easy as smoking a cigar on Sunday. One, I found the tower. Don't stop now, Danny. Find the guerrilla path and follow it to my contact. See, si. I'm on my way. Juan described you pretty well. My name is Raisa, and I'm going to be helping you steal shit from Castillo today. Are you going to tell me what I'm stealing? Depleted uranium. <laughs> Pardon. I thought you just said uranium. You heard me. Look, all I know is I burned my last contact in the army tracking it down for Juan. You ex-military? Isn't everybody? Okay. Just show me where it is. First, you take this parachute. Trust me, it can save your life. Now I'll take you to the old Spanish fort. They've got it locked up inside. Conscript or volunteer? Conscript. My number came up, so I did my time. You? Volunteer. All I wanted to be was a soldier. You know, wear the uniform, serve my country. Found out the only kind of soldier Castillo wants is a blind fascist addicted to his every word. So now you're a traitor. Yeah, and I'm not the only one. There's a guard posted at the watchtower ahead. He's going to let us use it to scout out the fort. He can also give us useful info. What does he want from us? One, not to get his ass shot. So keep your gun holstered or he'll open fire. Two, a little bribe to these double agents will get us military intel. Right. No weapons. Pesos ready. There he is. Hope you got some pesos on you. Hey, watch it. Keep walking. What do you got for me? Okay, check this out. Here's where you can find some weapons around here. Thank you. Sure. Whatever you and Raisa are about to do. Everyone's got their price. Not every soldier just an ass. Some are just trying to feed their families. Just remember to put the guns away before you approach them. Use your phone to scout up enemy soldiers and see their weaknesses. I bet Juan's already giving you his right tool for the right job talk. Where is the officer in charge? Alvarez has the key to the armory. Careful, Danny. 
He's higher rank. In Castillo's army, that means he's better trained, quicker with the trigger, and a tough motherfucker. This fort is the most protected base on the island. These soldiers have been issued with body armor and helmets. Nothing armor piercing rounds can't handle. Use the workbench if you need to craft some, and then go snatch that uranium, Danny. That parachute I gave you could come in handy. I stop that. I see you! the key to the armory. The uranium. Go your fucking uranium, Juan! Then get your ass back to me! Next time, the better... Oh yeah, Juan. Ha <laughs> ha! This is Resolver, Danny. Depleted uranium. Soviets left these sexy byproducts of nuclear enrichment behind in the 80s. Yankees use it for tank armor and bullets. <laughs> Crazy assholes. Sounds dangerous. You'll be a fucking superhero, Danny. Nita and I used to sneak these into the orphanage. Essential reading while waiting to fuck up convoys in the mud. A guerrilla must be a sponge for inspiration. Okay, but what the hell is this? This is a Supremo. Looks like a rocket launcher. See, she does that too. One more thing. I want you to meet Tostador. The two go together like fire and fury. I like how you reserve verse one. So do I. Hola. Hey. Supremos are like a good lover. Or a great sandwich. Are you just hungry, Juan? Yes. But I'm talking about layers, Danny. Head to the workbench and I'll show you. Supremos aren't just simple tools. Let's take a look at that Supremo. The special ingredient that makes this all happen is Supremo Bond. You need it to make your gadgets. Pick a gadget, Danny. This is a safe space. There's no wrong answer here.
Excellent. Now go talk to Clara. Time to give that Supremo a workout. Now go talk to Clara. Time to put that Supremo to use, guerrilla. Got nothing to say to you. Got a job for you. I don't need to tell you that Viviro is the lifeblood of Castillo's regime. He's built work camps to produce it all over Yara. These plantations use outcasts as slaves to grow the tobacco plants they turn into Viviro. These are our people, Danny. Beaten, tortured, sprayed by poison chemicals. There's a camp on this island. We tried to destroy it when we invaded. We failed. Now we're going to finish the job. Julio is waiting for you at a nearby barn. Hit that slave camp hard. Suerte. actually showed up. Listen, I'm not going to bullshit you. I wanted to do this alone, but Clara gave me an order. I can handle myself. Don't give a shit. So could Lita. She should be here right now, but instead I get you. And I'm supposed to be a Miami. But instead my two best friends are dead, and I'm stuck here with you. So, truce? Enough talk. Step one, we hit the tobacco. Step two, we destroy their poison supply. Step three, we get the fuck out of there, and Castillo gets a nice pretty message from Libertad. Got it. Take this gear. It'll protect you from fire, and more importantly, Castillo's fucking poison. in the right situation will keep you alive. Yeah, the right tool for the right job. Been hearing that a lot lately. Listen, Julio. Lita was like a sister to me. She shouldn't have been on that fucking boat. She died because of you, Ross. No. Anton Castillo killed Lita. If I could change anything, it would be me dying on that beach. Lita was a better person than I could ever be. And if she loved you, well, that just says a lot about who you are. Enough. Look, if you and I are going to do this, you need to know about the poison. You mean that shit they spray on the leaves? Its real name is PG-240, but we call it the poison because it fucked up your system. Try not to breathe it or get it on your skin. It can make you go fucking crazy or sick, like deep down sick. And if that doesn't get you, the cancer that grows inside you will. Coño. So you're military. Marksman? Close assault? What's your thing? I'm good with guns. We get along. We'll start thinking. That gear I gave you is good for fire and poison, but guerrillas need gear that fits their style, no matter the situation, or they get themselves killed. This is a good place to scout it. Right behind you. Let's see what we're up against. Up here! Dale. See the Viviro tobacco and the yellow poison tanks? See. Si. Punch holes in the tanks to let the poison out into the air. Fun fact, poison and fire make a hell of a mix. Big boom. Same idea with the fumigators. They're hard to kill, but they can't take the heat. You've got a flamethrower, 
You've got that Supremo. Time to fuck up all this Vaviro bullshit. You know, Lita and I had a ritual. Psych us up before battle. A song. Hit me. El movimiento de libertad. Oh, bella ciao, bella ciao. Bella ciao, ciao, ciao. <laughs> For Lita.
on my way. Burning sheet with a flamethrower? Not familiar. Shit, you really can hold your own. I don't want to say I told you so, but... Look, we should move. That was a hell of a light show, and they're going to see the smoke. We work well together. See, si. listen, if you are good with Lita, you're good with me. Gracias, Danny. Meet you back at camp. Thank <laughs> you.